Hello everybody, this is Steve Long and Mike Long with Fixing It With The Long Bros. And we're gonna uh, start our home project, our home uh, renovation series. Uh, we've already done some stuff like the door there, but I'm gonna walk through some of the things we're gonna be doing. And like this fence right here, we will do this fence eventually. Uh, we're gonna take, we're gonna take these decks this is what we came here with. We're gonna take these decks, we're gonna expand them out and they're gonna join together, the decks. And they'll be like right over there, you'll see the French doors. See the French doors? We're gonna also have uh, French doors here on this room right here. Look over here. Mike, you're good at what? There's gonna be French doors right here. That's where our mom's bedroom is that we built. And there will also be French doors right here right here this is the kitchen area so there'll be three doors going off one off that bedroom one off this living room yeah that'll be the living room then and this will be the kitchen area right here and these decks this is my bedroom right here with this lovely thing to keep anybody from looking in my room for right now but anyway we'll fix all that so hall, later on, you want people to look in your room? No, this, there'll be a wall right here. <laughs> right here, uh, we're going to do these fences. And it's a beautiful fence. And, uh, this is our bathroom. We tore down the walls. It was uh, we had an existing wall right there. It was a little girl's room. I think we got some pictures. I'm not sure. Anyway, some of that old uh, sheetrock and old again. stuff, we're getting rid of all of it. And we're reinforcing the existing uh, trusts, which were, you know, I don't see very well. But anyway, I just put that board up there, cut it, had to notch it in down there. There was only one old board there. You can see right behind there. Point at it, Steve. The old board behind the new one, right there. Okay. Anyway, that wasn't easy. <laughs> so nothing's easy. This is all wood uh, roof uh, boards. I think they're like half inch. So we're just going to put. New uh, two befores on each one of the trusts going up, so there'll be like a four by four, and uh, we'll come back later with another video. This is down the road we're going to be doing we're going to be putting uh, expanding this room up here this is a bedroom up top here and we're going to be expanding that out over the garage so it'll be a nice little apartment type thing it'll and be two here. story yeah, over here we're going to be building a shop well, this is going to take a little while but we're going to be building a shop to expand over the where the bus is so it's going to have its own little shop you got me in there too and uh, we'll be doing a shop and uh, back here we have a couple bolt sheds that, that we're going to be remodeling these old sheds stay right there these old sheds here we'll be remodeling or expanding to, we can have a little 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 uh, shop back here uh, and here over here you see that over here you have uh, our pump house 
Here's our little our pump house. <laughs> We're gonna paint it gray, I guess. Gray with white trim. White trim. We're gonna trim it out. Put some siding on it. A little overkill. I don't know. Increases the value of property. A little bit. That's all right. It's fine. Need one more piece for down here. Where we already showed, and if you haven't seen it, where we uh, had to pull the well and, and uh, put a new well, pump down there, 400 feet deep. And uh, eventually I want to build a tennis court here. See that, Mike? I want to show the molding. Okay, just made this molding for the uh, little sh shop outside, little, uh, pump house, pump house. where our uh, greenhouse is going to be, and we're going to paint this white, kind of a light gray white, it's beautiful, grayish, this type of molding I'm going to put around the Baseboards and crown moldings. Okay, Steve, you can paint them. Well, you're painting them too. I know that sling blade. Unless you wanted to. Nope. I want to do it too. Okay. Which one do you want to paint? This one. Okay. Dust off of them. Aren't they pretty? Hi. How long did it take you to make these? Three days. Three days. Well, <laughs> not three solid days. No, probably a good day. Probably six, eight hours. But you had to let the glue dry. I filled all the little knot holes, uh, nail holes. Paint will get some of this too. You look good, I must say. Okay, get your brush, bitch. Get the, uh, I'm a bitch. Get the brush. You got it? Nope. That's just going on the pump house. <laughs> Custom made. In the shade. Yes, indeed. All right. All right, then. The dust particles flying around. All the molding here we did. Built it out of uh, the ship lap that we got off the old building that was here. The, uh, where the old building was, it was actually out here. Cut across there. There's the well. Anyway, we want to do a swimming pool back here and a tennis court right where we're standing, pretty much. Come over here. I want to Just one second.
lots of uh, transmission. I was taking, I guess there's Spicers or something. Four speed transmission for a, it's a 1952 Silver Side 671 well, Detroit yeah. engine. There's the brake. Anyway, that's that's that. Let's see down here. It was, it was good. Anyway, yeah. Do this quickly and upbeat. Cut this back. It's probably pretty dark in here. Here's uh, some more wood that we got from uh, that building out there. Well, I'm not gonna pull it all out, but there's underneath there. There's some uh, these, these boards are that wide. <laughs> they're beautiful. They're they're 20. They're the length of this this thing. Yeah. 20 feet long at least. But watch out, gonna... watch out. We might be stepping on some friendlies. We're, we're going to uh, put those big pieces, 20 feet long, we're going to make them headers in the house. And so all this stuff is, will come together. All right. Anyway, that's what we're doing. And I uh, hope you go along with us. And uh, we're going to have fun doing it. It's going to take us a little while, but it also will be good filming and, and good viewing for uh, people who like to do their own renovations. That's it. Okay, it's here been we... It's forever. Huh? I said it's been there forever, so obviously it helped. But we're reinforcing it. All right, we're going to put another 2 before alongside that old 2 before. We just got through doing that one, which took quite a while. The, the roof had come down some, so I had to get that in there, trimming and whatnot. And put a two before right along here, up there, and then there's where the <coughs> truss goes down. They had put these little cross pieces in. You see there, that's that's their braces for the roof truss down to the cross piece and some of them are just doing nothing I don't know I guess that's their idea but I'm gonna get rid, short. get rid of that stuff they're just short they, 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 did, they did fine I cut, it's just not in line they didn't you know why they did that because the it's such a low ceiling yeah, well. So they just put it alongside of it. They did it wrong. Yeah, they should have. They didn't build the truss right. At any rate, we're going to fix them. See how we got to notch them? You see it? Yeah. And we have a template made over there so we can do the rest of them. Oh, here we go. clamp in there. That's not it. Don't. I need to trim the... Some I more? I need to trim the angle a little bit. Alright. I think you are. Up top? No, yes, maybe? I'll give me the clamp. Now nail it down there. Okay, there you go, sling blade. You better be careful stepping on that. Push that in. Let me push that in. Huh? Or use a clamp. Because there's such a gap. Use your clamp, Mr. Clampid. Yeah. 
It needs to go up. Push it up. You don't have to film it. There it's going. All right. All right, we uh, raising the ceiling. Raising the ceiling. <laughs> and we're uh, putting new brackets up, uh, braces up there. That's not focused very well. So we tied it in there. It's going to be eight feet high ceiling now from 87 inches. Level. We got it level. So it's two by six, and we're gonna be putting little chunks up there, <laughs> and then uh, get to bring it a, bring it up, bring the roof up a little bit, and then we're putting uh, Mike's cutting some braces right now. That will go on the two by six right here, cupped, cupped around the. The uh, trusses, roof trusses, and uh, so that should secure it really good. And we'll go all the way across eventually. So there you have it. That's what we're doing. ceiling was so low, you just reach up and grab it. It was 87 inches high. So anyway, that's the name of that tune. bottom trusses out for the ceiling all right we're we're raising the roof is what we're doing and uh, we've got the first beam in there and we've got it uh, stabilized over there and stabilized over there. I had to uh, build uh, a little uh, slot brace. It's connected to the main beam going across there. We got it hooked there to that beam, to that beam. Anyway, that's eight foot one inches high. And we're going to be going two foot to center. I got them marked over there. I don't know if you can see that or not, but we're going to be putting some over there. Two foot to the left, right there, across the little beam there. We'll put some supports in. We're going to put a uh, door here to the patio, get rid of that window right there. And then we're going to solidify this wall more. That's going to be to the living room eventually. But this is a bathroom. So we'll be getting rid of those uh, crossboards. And then uh, we'll film more later. All right. I came from the mud. There's dirt on my head.
catch me hollering at the moon.